The annual Warren Haynes Christmas Jam is this weekend, and the very first show happened this afternoon in a family's new front yard. Haynes performed for the first time ever in front of a Habitat for Humanity home that proceeds from the jam helped to build. News 13's Ashley Searles is live in West Asheville. And Ashley, it meant a lot to Haynes to be there today. He said today that it did. The Christmas Jam is one of Asheville's biggest events of the year. As you can imagine, it takes a lot to plan, but still 24 hours ahead of time, Warren Haynes was able to make it down here to this home site today. When you can find the light to guide you through cloud and day. Dozens of volunteers were there, not for the show, but because it was their day to work, to hammer and nail, to do it for free, and to do it all for others. These are hardworking families, and they're earning a living, but they don't earn enough to purchase a home in, on the open market. Habitat for Humanity has already built a handful of homes here on Soulshine Court. But this one will be special. You see where the money's going. We, we see the houses we're building. This four-bedroom, two-bath house on a West Asheville cul-de-sac is the 2014 Christmas Jam House, made possible by the concert Warren Haynes himself hosts here in his hometown every year. Ever since I started meeting the families, it just kind of puts you a little closer to the reality. Of this house is the future home of the Garcia Sanchez family. This is the future for our daughters, for our family. Carlos Garcia works third shift in a manufacturing job. Owning a home, he says, is an opportunity he never thought he'd have. It changes the life in all ways. Having a warm place to be, not getting wet, mm, space. It just changes your world. Garcia teared up, thanking volunteers. God bless you all. He said now his family can do things like plant flowers without asking the landlord. That's your piece of world. And I want to leave something for my family in the future. The family will move in this spring. That was beautiful. Habitat for Humanity staff say that more and more families are putting in to be part of this program every single day. Reporting live tonight in West Asheville, I'm Ashley Searles, News 13.